Okay. Well. You. I think I know your mother's name now. If you really are a friend, you will know my mother's name. The name that haunts me. A beautiful name. But I know it. Let me just think for a second. Is it Sheila? Sheila. Yes. It was my mother who sent you, after all. I'm sorry I didn't believe you. But my head's all messed up. So, let's have a little chat, sweetheart. How do you know how to get... Oh, oh my god, how do you know? <laughs> do you know how to get out of here? Something's wrong with this place. Do you know how to get out of here? Do you know how to get out of here? We're not supposed to get out. We must stay here. Do what they say. Take pills they give us. Sometimes, if I behave, they give me the red stuff. I wait for it. I'm being good. What is this red stuff? It's a drug. My favorite one. Red stuff takes the pain away. I must stay here. Good nurses have been most kind. They always remember. They know I'm suffering. But it is not the same as the drugs I see in my dreams. On the other side of the mirror, there's a spider's heart full of drugs. I just can't seem to find it anymore. I see. Um, okay. So... What exactly is this little treat you mentioned? Are you alright? You feel like sharing? What's your name? How's about we swap name bands? Ooh. Yeah. How about we swap our name bands? Oh yeah, I don't mind. But that would be like a favor to you, yeah? <laughs> no. Well, technically, you wouldn't lose anything, because I'd give you my name band instead. Does that make any sense? Sure, yeah. I do want something better in return, though. I'm not that stupid. I know you'll use it to get out of here. Oh, I never said you're stupid. I... I just really want to go home. Please understand. That's fine. I don't mind. I'll give it to you if you get me the red stuff. What do you say? I thought nurses give it to you anyway. No, not that. I'm talking about the real thing. Something you can only get in the world of dreams. Now that is something special. Is it safe? It's perfectly safe. Um, okay. I'll see what I can do. If I understand correctly what she's saying about this spider heart or whatever, we probably have to do something with that. Meaning we're gonna have to get high as fuck again. So let's let's ask her what she means by this little treat. Although I think I just figured it out. What exactly is this little treat you mentioned? It's the red teardrop of pure happiness. They bring it, I drink it down, and my pain goes away. Without it, I just feel so angry. It's like I'm going crazy. <laughs> it's funny, but I just get so fucking angry sometimes. I'm dying, I think. We're all dying, I heard. She said I'd go to hell for it. But I didn't do anything. I didn't know. Does he know? Who? Him! Right. Okay. No, probably not. I need the red medicine. I need it now. I must be a good girl. I must be a nice girl. Maybe I could get you some of that stuff. Do you know where they keep it? Oh, they have it hidden well. You can't get there. Or maybe you can. I see it in my dreams sometimes. It's where the nurses are. But in my dream, there are no nurses there. I see it, but I can't get it. It's so near, and yet so far. I can still hear the broken heartbeat of the spider's heart. Hmm. Are you alright? 
Are you all right? I'm fine. Yes, it's all fine. It's just hard to wait, you know? They said I can have it. You know, yeah? So I wait here. Don't want to miss it. That nurse promised it to me. The one with the red glasses. But I think it's been three hours already. Why are they late? Do you think something happened? Do you think she changed her mind? Because I swear if she did, I will hurt myself again. I swear to God, I will hurt myself again. I'm sure they'll be here in a minute. They're probably just very busy, that's all. Oh my god, I'm gonna talk to you later. I'll talk to you later, yeah? Yes, go. Be careful, they're watching us. And remember, we must be nice to earn the red stuff. Always be nice. Poor woman. Okay, so this is what I'm thinking I have to do. So I'm going to go back into the restroom. I'm going to enter. And actually, I'm going to look in here. There's empty, small medicine pots in here. Well, oh, could I do that before? Could I search it before? I'll take one of these medicine pots. Okay, so I'm thinking we're gonna need that. Also, these gloves. I'm thinking if if I can, I'm gonna try and clog the um, toilet with it. So let let me see. Let's use. Oh my god. Okay, now let's flush it. Oh yeah. So now I'm gonna ring this bell. And I'm gonna be a huge asshole. Since there's no staff, she's gonna have to do it. No cleaning staff, in particular. Someone is coming. She's gonna have to unclog this toilet. Have you rang the bell? Is there an emergency? The toilet's blocked. What? Ah, uh, well, that's hardly an emergency. Um, it is when you need to use it urgently, like I do. I see. Fine. I'll sort it out. Just give me a minute. Ah, oh, it's the gloves. Again! I guess I'll have to get my hands dirty since the cleaner's called in sick. Oh. Yes, she's distracted. Oh, wait. Oh. Wait, so yeah, I can get the things, but... Yes, that's exactly what I need. I can finally go home. Well, no, because we still need we still need the name band. So maybe I did this a little early. I don't know. What'll happen if? Um... All right. Let's see if we can try and get drugged up again. Let's see what happens. Oh, enter. It wasn't you who did it, was it? I don't know what you're talking about. Someone just stuck a bunch of... Well, I guess it doesn't matter. It's sorted now. I just hope it's the last time I've put my hands in that stinking toilet. It's not. You're gonna do it again. But... I'm gonna have to ring her again because we have to get doped up and I believe I have everything I need to go get that weird pulsating heart thing. We are just annoying the fuck out of this woman. Someone is coming. Have you rang the bell? Is there an emergency? I just wanted to remind you I'm ready to go home. I pressed it by mistake, sorry. Uh, I wanted to see how long it would take you to answer the bell. I'm feeling a bit woozy. Let's see that one. I'm feeling a bit woozy. Are you really? You look fine to me. 
No, I I'm really not feeling well. Fine, I'll call the doctor for you. But I can't help it if he's busy and can't get here straight away. In the meantime, I know how to make you feel better. I think it's time we give you some medication. Can you please tell me your name and your date of birth? Mind your business. I'm not taking anything. Mind your own business. I'm not taking anything. I don't think so, darling. Now, you really don't have to lie. We're only trying to help you now. Now, let me have a quick look at your name band. Miss Ashworth, I strongly suggest you take this, alright? Fine, I'll take it. That's a good girl. Now, drink it down. You'll feel much better. I know. Movie high as fuck. Now, go back to your room and rest. You'll be able to relax and have a great sleep. So we've done that. Now we're gonna go back into the weird um, waiting room area, whatever this is. And we're gonna stab it. Yes. Let's use the medicine pot. Let's use. I need to get the fuck out of here. Uh -oh. Let's enter. And let's sleep this off. I swear, I get an accent like every time I freaking play this game. Yeah, that was pretty fucked up. But, anyways, we've got the red stuff. The drugs have worn off, and I feel better now. But I can't let them do that to me again. I need to get out of here. We're almost there, Susan. We just need the name band, and then everything will be fine. Actually, no. Let me go back in here and get some more gloves, because I think I have to clog the toilet again so that I can leave. Let's take a lot of them. Like, let's take the whole fucking box. And then we're going to give her the red stuff. Actually, no. We're just going to give it to her. So we need to talk to her give. Wait, oh, wait, I can drink it? What'll happen if I drink it? <gasps> I'm curious. Hold on. I'm gonna pop a hot save and then I'm gonna be right back. Alright, so I saved it. So let me see what'll happen if I drink it myself. Let's see. I've had enough drugs already. Drinking this is probably gonna kill me. Oh, come on. I thought that was possible. Fine, let's give it to her then. I've found the thing you asked me for, but are you absolutely certain it won't harm you? Don't be silly. Of course it won't. Fine. I hope you know what you're doing. Can I have your name band now, please? Yes. No matter what they say, I do keep my promises. What do they... You know what? It doesn't matter. Yeah, just get the name band so we can get the fuck out of here. Thank you for your help. Yes. So. Did she go in her room? No. Where'd she go? Hmm. That's strange. Okay. Well. We're gonna go in the bathroom. And we're just making this lady this day, like horrible we're gonna stuff the toilet again and then we're gonna freaking tell her to come in here and unclog it and then we're gonna make our great escape so let's actually no we don't need to do that let's grab this use Ugh. oh my god susan come on bitch So now we're going to put the gloves in. I already got what I wanted. Uh, I don't have to do it again. Oh, what? Oh, okay. Well, fine. I ain't know that. 
I thought we had to distract her. She knows we're Susan, so... I didn't think about that. Yeah, she won't mind if we go in the fucking hallway, because she knows the dudes are going to stop me anyway, so it doesn't matter. Sorry, Mom, can't let you through. We'll need to see a discharge letter from your doctor first. Here. Are you happy now? Yes, that seems fine. Can I just check your name band to confirm that you are indeed Anne Burton? Oh, all right. I didn't realize you knew how to read. There you go. Can I go now? Of I course. Swear. Thank you, Mom. She's a fucking savage. We'll see you soon. No. You won't. Yeah, that... Now get out of my way. Yeah, that was a bad thing to say. We'll see you soon. Oh, yes. Let's get out of here. It's locked. Okay. Open. It's also locked. Okay, that's fine. Let's get the fuck out of here. We don't care about anything else. Oh. And you must be Susan Ashworth. Um, well... Perhaps I am? Do you mind if I ask you where you're heading to? I was just going for a little walk, stretch my legs, get some fresh air. Give it a rest? I'm not going anywhere. Miss Ashworth, please relax. There's been a mistake. You have been prescribed wrong medication. I apologize sincerely on behalf of my team and the hospital, but luckily we managed to spot it on time. On time? You have no idea what I've been through? Once again, I'm truly sorry. I promise no more drugs will be given to you. I personally guarantee you will have a good, peaceful sleep tonight, and you can be discharged in the morning. Why can't I go tonight? I want to go now! I'm really sorry, but we can't legally discharge suicidal patients without a full psychiatric assessment. It's too late for it now, but I promise we'll have a chat in my office first thing in the morning, okay? And then you can go home. Is that all right? I haven't really got much choice, have I? Alright guys, that is the end of part, what is this, five? Yeah, <laughs> that's the end of part five. If you guys are enjoying this series, please give me a like, and if you happen to stumble across my channel, be sure to subscribe, and I am just Nikki, signing off. Bye guys.